Okay, just on today's lesson on Finchute, we're going to show you a few different ways to find equity stocks. We're also going to show you how to actually dive into a bit more of the financial information of those stocks, look at the ownership of them and the management of those particular stocks. So let's just duck straight into it. There are three ways to find an equity. Uh, one of those particular ways is if you know the stock code and the exchange, you can type that straight in. Let's take for an example Google. We can type in Goog US equity, equity button, followed by the go, and that will bring up this information screen here. Now this is basically the any different equities homepage screen, and we want to be able to come to this screen. So there are two more methods to get to this. One is that you can actually press the F8 equity key straight away to get here. <clears throat> and once you're here, you can actually search for the security itself. So within here, under company name, we want to search for Google. So if you're unsure which one you're searching for, uh, it'll, it'll always have it by relevance here. So this is the one that we're interested in. We can click on this here. And once again, we get to this screen. The other way is if you're unsure about the name or the exchange, you can actually start to type Google into the top here and it'll actually come down and show you the security. So you can click directly on that as well and that will bring us to this screen. So to ensure that you're on the right stock that you've just typed in, a good place to start is by looking at security description here or you can actually type DES straight in and we'll bring you here. One important thing to note is that there actually are four pages to any description screen. So this will show you uh, the just a straight up profile of it, give you a bit of information here on it, a little bit on management which we'll look at later, issue information, ratios, <clears throat> and revenue and earnings per share. So here under revenue or FA is going to give all your financial information. So we can get to that again by typing F8 into the nav bar and this will bring up all the financial information on an equity. So what's really good about this is that you have your income statement here, you will have your balance sheet, you'll have your cash flow statement here. You also have a whole lot of ratios you can choose from, obviously profitability here, you can have a look at liquidity ratios, there's a whole lot of stuff you can play with. But we're not going to spend too much time on that because we will look at that in another tutorial. So what I want to have a look at now is the ownership of Google. So I'm going to type own directly in the nav bar and that will bring me to this ownership screen. Now this breaks it up into institutional ownerships, insider ownership, different ownership types and geographic ownerships of the particular company. What I might be interested in for an example though is transactions or insider transactions. So I can click on that up here on the grey tab which will then load this up onto a chart. Now this can get a bit busy so if you like you can just zoom into a certain area and this will actually show you the buying and selling of the particular stock by insiders. So take um, this one here for an example, we can have a look at this and set. this loads up here. Um, this is one of the directors of Google and sale of 200 shares at that particular price on that day. Now if you're not sure of who the different owners are, uh, at a, I guess at a director level, we can have a look at that too. So in the top bar you can type MGMT to get to management, followed by go, and that will bring this up. So from here you've got a lot of information you can play with as well. You can actually chart and have a look at this if you're using it on documentation. So we can look at Larry Page here and have a look at his um, time as CEO, which is there. And obviously this will break this down here to Eric Schmitz as well. But if you want more information on him and actually have a look at Larry Page, you can. You can click on this here and it'll bring up his bio and you can find a lot of information here that might be useful to you for any reporting. So you can actually look at bull and bears as well, which give you a bull case analysis for his holdings in the company, as well as a bear case analysis for his holding in the company. So that's just one example of how you can look at into management on Finchute. We will go through more 
and people searches and management at a later date. Thank you for watching.